Welcome. So today I am with Huawei P40 and I'm going to show you how to in easy way download and install Google services on the smartphone. Uh, you have to get like SD card and uh, uh, adapter or any other external storage and download the Huawei zip file on your external storage. I just did it and the link of course you will find it in the description of this video. So uh, if you just get it on your external storage just plug in into your Huawei and right now we have to go to the files oh, sorry to the files and scroll down tab on the USB driver and right now there's our Huawei zip click and hold it tab on the more extract to current directory okay uh, this notification is not going to pop on your screen. Um, I just going to do this, this another time and that's why it's here. There's override, right? So there's the notification that you will get uh, when you try to extract. Okay, and right now we have to go to the settings and we have to enter the system and updates and tap on the Backup and restore, data backup, next, agree, external storage, USB storage, and click on this one. There's the free apps, so tap on the restore, and we have to input the password. The password is here. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and zero. Done. Okay. Tap on it, done. Right now we can go back to our files and we can start installing the Google services. So again on the USB driver and tap on right now, not on the Huawei zip. Instead of this, tap on the Huawei file. And let's start with the Google Play services. And I highly recommend you to click on don't ask me again because this notification is going to pop up on a very application installation process. So tap on the install. Um, account manager Google Play Store there is the Google contacts and right now we have to go back to main settings click and hold on this big G icon Tap on the activate, allow, and we can tap on this button and all on this also. Now just uh, turn it off and enter settings. Tap on the users and accounts, add an account, and we have go for the Google. Okay, and if you don't have the Google account, you have to create a new. But I got it, so click on exist existing. And let me just sync my email and the password. Okay, and if you did it, just tap on the done. And the next window is this one, tap on the next. And right now we have to go back to the files and finish the installer process. So right now, on the Huawei and tab on the Google Services Framework. Done. This one. And the last one file. Okay, oh, sorry. And right now we can unplug our external storage.
and now we can try to open the Google Play Store but in most cases we have to reboot our smartphone okay so just click hold and restart okay and right now we can unlock our smartphone and don't be worried about this notification because right now we are going to turn it off so enter the settings tap on the apps apps again click here on this right upper corner show system process on the search type the google and enter all of these google applications on notifications and turn it off Okay, and right now we can go back to the Google Play Store. And as you can see, this is how it works. We can go for the Instagram. And we can also download the YouTube. And Facebook also. And when we download these applications, we can <clears throat> we have to also go to the settings and turn off notifications because uh, we'll get this spamming notify screen. So let's stop on the YouTube. And as I said, this is the first notification. So let's go back to the apps, find YouTube, enter notifications, and permanently turn off. And this is how it looks guys, really cool, I hope that I'll help you, if I do leave thumbs ups, comments and of course subscribe to our channel.